Hey everybody, in today's video, you're gonna learn how to set up your GoDaddy domain in Groove. But before we get into that, make sure you like and subscribe below so that you don't miss any of these 50 and 50 videos where we're trying to get into everything you need to know to build your funnel with Groove. Let's take a look. So let's get started with adding a domain to our Groove account. So within Groove, once we're logged in, we're gonna to go to the upper right to this profile button and we're gonna click that. Then once we click that, we're gonna to go to my domains. And from here, we're gonna choose a custom domain and manage. Now we're gonna to go to add a domain and we're gonna do full domain subdomain setup. Here's where we're gonna type in the name of the domain. So we're gonna put a new domain into our account and we're gonna choose GrooveCMHelper.com. So let's put that in here, GrooveCMHelper.com. And once we do that, we click Next. Now it's gonna tell me, connect your domain in a few simple steps. Log into your account with your domain provider. We've done that. So then it says, update the name servers. So how we do that in GoDaddy is first of all, we copy this and then we go into the domain, GrooveCM Helper in this case, in the domain and we're gonna go down to manage DNS. And from here, we're gonna change the name servers. And we have to enter my own name servers at the bottom. And here's where we're gonna paste in that first domain name server. The second one will copy, paste, and save. Now, with GoDaddy, we always have to do one more step, say yes, I consent, I understand it's risky, all that good stuff, and we click continue. All right, your request is in progress. Uh, most of these name server uh, changes take an hour. What we're gonna do is go back to Groove and we're gonna do what we need to do in Groove. So we'll say next, and we can either do this later or we can do it right away. So we click validate DNS records. And what we're gonna do it says down here that is in process, you need to wait at least an hour, but we don't need to do wait necessarily an hour. We're just gonna click complete this process. And so you can see here that it's pending verification. And now we have a button that says click to verify the domain. So if you give it 15 minutes, 30 minutes, uh, you don't just try it if you want to, but we're gonna give it 15 minutes. Okay, after waiting, let's give it a try. You just click verified domain shows us the name servers again we click validate dns records and we're going to get the red error message don't worry about that uh, just means we have to wait a little bit longer so we're going to wait another 10 15 minutes okay so once we're back here we are at the same place we click validate dns and boom it turned green we've completed that step now the final step and getting active, this domain active in your account, is we need to choose a primary app for this domain. So when we click the button, it's gonna show us the list of possible apps that we can connect this domain to. Uh, Groove Pages, Groove Cell Branding, Groove Cell Tracking, Groove Member Memberships, uh, Groove Member Portal, Groove Blog, and Groove Cart. So if we're gonna build a, a site or a funnel at Groove, uh, like GrooveCMHelper.com, then Groove Pages is going to be the primary app that we're going to connect to. But let's say we're going to have a, a membership or a, an academy, GrooveCMHelpAcademy.com. All we want to see is we want people to come right to the membership. We would use Groove Member as the main primary app. If we have a portal, we're going to do the same thing. And this is gonna, in other words, be the thing that's on the main domain, www.groovecmhelper.com. If you want them to go directly to a blog, you really don't have a site 
or a funnel or anything. You just have a blog. You would use group blog as your primary app or if you just want to store, right? And this would be if we don't have, again, a site or a funnel. We just have a store we want to send people to. We would use GrooveCart as our primary app. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose Groove Pages, which is the most common app that we would use for primary. And I'm going to click check mark. And that is almost all we need to do to get the domain ready to go. The final thing you need to be aware of is connecting your email, your mailbox to this domain, not Groove Mail, but your email box. And so we do that with this DNS button here. And when we come in there, we have the ability to add records to the DNS table. And so, for example, if you're using uh, Google Mail, if you're using uh, Namecheap private email, or if you're using uh, Microsoft 360, uh, Zoho, I mean, there are a lot of options. Any of those, each of those is going to have their own specific records that we have to put in here. And so when we do that, we're going to add records. Um, primarily, we're going to have to put MX records here. Those are our mail records. We could add an SPF, an SRV, or a TXT. But here's the thing. The way to know what you're going to add is defined in each one of your mailbox hosts. So that would be if you have Google Mail, you're going to look at their descriptions of where to find that. If you have Zoho or private email, any of those, we're going to go look at those to find what we need to put into our account. So I'm going to put some links in the descriptions that you can use to go and find what your specific MX records are to define for the internet where to find your mailbox. Okay, I hope that was helpful and it really cleared some things up for you in regard to domains with Groove. And make sure you check out the other videos. Again, like and subscribe below. Check out the other videos we have on all kinds of things related to how to set up Groove, how to set up your funnel, how to set up your pages and everything hopefully that you need to know. If you have something specifically you would like to learn, please put it in the comments and we'll make sure we'll try to make a video specifically for your needs. All right. Thanks for joining us at Groove Tutorials.